The organisation Undoing Tax Abuse Are Out uh, says it's not surprised by the latest Corruption Perceptions Index report released today. The report has revealed that corruption is getting worse in South Africa and government's attempts to curb it are simply not working. The country attained its lowest score ever of 41 out of 100. Arta says there, this is because there's no political will to address corruption, despite many promises made by President Cyril Ramaphosa administration first of all we're not surprised we would have been surprised had it gone up it is sad that we are continuously regressing and going backwards just a couple of years ago we were at about 44 we're down to 41 and that's not good out of a score of 100 i mean the highest scoring country is denmark at 90 so that's excellent and right down to the 11 so uh, where we really it is uh, corruption is rife so we're about middle of the field we're slightly in the bottom half or we're below average. Uh, the average is about 43. But the fact is that we're going backwards, and that's a real concern, especially on the fact that, you know, Sul Ramaphosa came into office on the back of an anti-corruption ticket and stance. Uh, we've had state capture. We've had the Zonda Commission. With all of that ammunition, we, you would think we would be turning the corner and going in the right direction, but we're not. We're regressing and we're going backwards. And that's a sad state of affairs for this country. When we see what's happening since state capture, by the way, since Ramaphosa has come into power, the the absolute abuse of the of the procurement systems, more so at local government, is diabolical. It is atrocious what is going on and how much money is being wasted there and at provincial level. I don't have to remind you about the Tembisa Hospital, the Babita Diokaran, people not being held accountable when the evidence is so very clear. So there's a political interference issue. There's a lack of political will. And we are just really treading water. And in so doing in the fight against corruption, you're actually sinking. And we should be moving ahead a lot faster. The anti-corruption uh, 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 commission or committee that's been put together is taking a long time to get to where it should be uh, in, in its structures and its work. Uh, the list goes on, Dan. I'm, I'm afraid we are far off the mark from where we should have been five years down the line under this new administration.